Shamai GTA chums, yesterday I showed you uh, one of the worst businesses in the entire game um, but today I'm going to show you one of the best. This is the Acid Lab sale, it's on uh, one and a half times money so we should be making a bit more money today for this one. This is a multi drop, oh five drops, it's not so bad five drops but let's see where we are going to be going. So we're starting off out here in the bung bungalies and we are going to go into the city so this is going to be uh, more of a long video and where I just do what actually happens. And maybe we'll see some griefers, I don't know, there's about 20 odd people in this session, some of whom could be of um, dodgy reputation, who knows. But we will find out as soon as we get this uh, delivery on. There's a guy in a plane, I think they're okay, there's no lasers out there at the moment, or hydras, so <laughs> I've not seen any Mark II because I have only just joined the session. So, currently favourable, but that doesn't mean it's not going to change massively. But, I'm a bit more confident than I was yesterday, because this delivery bike is a lot better. It can, uh, I, don't, I, think it, I don't think you can lock onto it with the Mark II Oppressor either, and it can take a few hits. Um, it's a lot more difficult to destroy, but you can destroy it if, if your griefer, if you allow your grief enough time. The trick is, um, basically as soon as you start getting griefed, especially if you get blown off the motorbike, find a new session you will lose a small portion but it's a lot better than losing it all don't try and fight them off like i tried one time that's the only time i lost um lost um my goods basically by trying to fight them which you know i wasn't good enough at, at um, headshots basically and allowed them the time to blow the bike up while it was prone it was somewhere around this kind of area when it, when it happened a bit, a bit further out so we've got 0.64 and the way these deliveries should work, I think this might be the ones where we just go and hide them underneath a bench or something, a park bench. Um, so the police come out sometimes. I think it's that one. We'll see when we get there. And I don't seem to have any kind of doodars on me. So let's let's have a little look. Maybe I should get some sticky bombs out. That's another little trick. If you have any mark to oppress is chasing you. Well, here we go. Yeah, we need to find somewhere to plop it. So I'm going to go out to the back here because hopefully any police will not see me. And another, oh crap, what is that guy doing? Some guy coming right towards me, come on, drop it. Yeah, before I got into this little yellow circle, I should have um, planned the next one, just in case. Yeah, there we go, police. Oh, that's an epic miss, wasn't it? What the hell? we got two stars to lose. Christ, on a bike. Um, I am actually on a bike, but I am not Christ. Um... Yeah, I mean, it gets a little bit a little bit frustrating trying to um, deal with the police and the potential griefers, but that's life, you know. It's what makes it fun, isn't it? Um, so we're going to go down to the... Um, oh, there we go, Mark to Oppressor on. So let's go towards the Mark to Oppressor. That's a good idea, isn't it? Oh, feck. Get out of my way, man. Get out of my way. Let's get the uh, compact EMP launcher. Sticky bombs are what we're going to need for the Mark II. A bit of a snuffles, bit of snuffles there. What is that noise? Why is stuff blowing up? Because there's a Mark II, of course. Okay, he's fine, he's fine. Let's see if he follows me down. If he does, he's going to get a bomb on him. <laughs> I got him. There we go. Daniel XX12 or whatever. Christ, no Come on, where's my bike? Give me a bike, man. Yeah, this is why it can be a bit frustrating. Remember I said you need to get the fuck out of there. Get the freak out of there, man. He's not, he doesn't know what to do. He's lost his Mark II Oppressor. Ah, oh, right, okay. Where the hell am I? There we go, we're down there. We are down there, let's go. Let's just go and hide from this utter top. Oh, for feck's sake, come on, man. Yeah, no stress. Why the hell did that happen? He doesn't know what to do without his Mark II Oppressor, so that's good. Yeah, we're going to try and do this. We're going to try and do it. Sometimes they just blow you off to have a bit of fun, not necessarily to destroy your bike, but uh, your goods. So we're going to see how we do with our griefing on this one. If not, we might find a new session. Get the radar out, also get a some kind of minigun or something. Come on, mate. Lose the cops. 
I mean, the Mark II oppressor should never have been put in the game in the first place. It just makes it too easy. But at least if you have some stickies on board, you've got half a chance. Come on, lose the filth, come on. Yeah, a lot of weight in here. Um, hold on, let's have a look. Oh, there we go, okay, we're gone. Let's get our sticky bombs out again. So where the hell are we? Where the devil are we? We've got to go down in there. Okay, that's where we're going to go. We know where we're going to go now. So we are going to try and get there if we can. Without any too much of a commotion. This guy is out here. What's he up to? Don't know. Hopefully he's not called his terabyte. Let's get his back to a presser out, but that's life, isn't it? Oh, he's got a nice car. He's got one of them fancy ones, doesn't he? With the uh, look like a, a bolt, a convertible bolt. Yeah, not Rolls Royce. The other one, Bentley, isn't it? Big Bentley. Okay, let's try and stash it here again. Uh, again, I haven't clicked the right place. Damn it! If we're getting lucky, if we get two, but I ain't going to rule it out because life is not always going to give you a freebie. I'm not also showing you how to do it properly, am I? Ridiculous. Okay, we've got another one. Another Mark II Oppressor is in the air, so we're going to see how we do with that one. And see if we can survive. Not got the right gun yet again. Need stickies. I mean, you could do with a bit of both. Sometimes you're shooting people as well. Let's get the radar out big. Where are we going, man? Let's just go down this way. There's somebody hanging out there, which is kind of unfortunate. Hopefully it's not our chum, and we can make it. I thought this was going to be quite an easy one, really. That was my initial thoughts. I thought, well, this will be easy. Sometimes it isn't, though, is it? <laughs> Sometimes they're tricky ones. I mean, all the griefers are out. Seems I've been having quite a bit of luck. Oh, I need to find my next one, don't I? Oh, what, what's that Mark II Oppressor doing? Hanging out there, just... Next one is north, so that's good. We're going to dump it in here, and then... Hopefully we don't have the police on our tail. Try down here because it's hidden. Let's just get the bike ready for an exit. And hide it behind these pallets. Come on, mate. Let's see it. Let's see it. There we go. Okay, anybody on? Luco15. He's he's safe so far. He's not on a mark to oppress us, so that is good. Um, remember, if you watched the video from yesterday, it's only a three minutes long. It'll show you just how easy it is to grief the MC biker stuff because that this would have been destroyed if it was set up just like the MC biker stuff because they can just lock on but it's funny how that guy followed me into the tunnel a, a good trick get under a bridge and then throw a sticky bomb at them they'll soon learn you know one way or another but the best thing is to blow them up or just find a new session if you're not com confident with stickies again that's why um, the um, the buffalo STX and that kind of thing is so good because what is this chum doing because they are. Uh, oh, he's in a Formula 1 car. He can't actually shoot out of that, so that is good. Um, but the STX, because it's got the Im Imani tech, so... <laughs> come on, don't don't come out filth. Don't come out filth. Oh, yes, they are out again. Can we for now, dude? Yeah, I'm getting a bit bored of the filth now. Where is he? Lester Jester. Let's see if he is going to come out. You can, we can try and lose them the, tradi the traditional way. Yeah, if it isn't my creepy, silent friend. Oh, there we go. How can I help? Lester works. I thought that worked, yeah. Heat, but okay. I had a problem with that Leave before. With Maybe because there's a cooldown. That's. But yeah, the Lester Jester method. And then we're going to get to our final stash. Where the hell is it? Just along the road there. I thought it was there, but losing confidence in my own skills at uh, direction forming, finding, which is normally excellent. I have an excellent sense of direction in real life. Maybe not in the game. I mean, pull wheelies for speed. You can actually turn a bit with your wheelies as well, which is quite, quite good. Um, so, yeah. Overall, you're going to see how much money we're going to make pretty soon. And this, um, if you do your your acid acid lab, it, you can enhance it once per per 24 hour period or day or something. You know, not in game day. Um, and it significantly speeds up the production. So. As soon as you do your sale, and you, if you're going to carry on playing the game, make sure you do that um, to, to make sure you get the most out of it. One and a half times money though, so we're going to see how much we make. 
hopefully we still, oh, 28 people, so we've got a maximum once we deliver this lot and get out of there safely, of course. Um, there we go. Okay, we're just going to dump it out back because it's probably a bit easier. Le less, less people are going to see us. You can see there's nobody watching. Come on, mate. Nobody watching at all, so it shouldn't get the police out. It's the last one. I don't know if it does get the police out on the last one anyway, which, you know, it shouldn't do just for fairness. We're probably going to go and do our little races. Um, we're going to do some races now, I think. So we'll go back into town, but we're going to see first how much money we're going to make. Which is very nice. So 750 grand. That's pretty good for one and a half times money. Normally you would make 500 grand, um, well, obviously, in a full session. So you can make a lot of money um, doing your acid lab sales. If you found that useful, yeah, you know what to do. Give me your, give me your suggestions down below on how to evade the market to oppressors and how to get your sales done. Did I do the, the best method there? Do you think I did well? Anyway, thanks for watching and have a great day.